Hi guys, I'm some Lego Twink and welcome to my Hi guys, I'm some Lego Twink and welcome to my YouTube channel where I review all of the Lego and Lego compatible sets in my collection. So today I'm going to be talking about oh my gosh, I um went to the Lego shop and I got some sets because of course I did. You know me, you know me. I mean I'm some Lego Twink, not some non-Lego Twink. Anyway, um so yeah, I got a lovely pick a brick hole. So basically I got two boxes. Two boxes of um, pick a brick parts. I'm really excited, just so excited to show you. Too excited. Anyway, so without further ado, let's get on to it. So basically, um, yeah, this is my lovely Lego bag that I got. And as you can see, I've already um, built something out of it. So it is this thing, which I'm going to be using for my massive um, container ship. So all of these parts, I managed to fit in a... Um, lovely uh, box. I did that by literally just stacking them up over and over again and literally fitting them inside. I mean the box didn't close but you know they let me get away with it because I, I don't know. I managed to um, sweet talk my way out of it let's say. Um, so yeah let me just take out the other part. So it is this box here and um, okay they're being a bit awkward. Okay that's the box and um, that is the other box and I also have two cups of pieces as well. So Okay, so what you see on the table right now is all the pieces that I managed to get out of the Lego shop while I was there. So again, these are the uh, Lego um, boxes. So again, you just fold them up and everything. I mean, they say, you know, um, they have to close, but they don't like have to have to close. Take it from me because, you know, I filled up my boxes so many times. And as long as like, it's like, um, as long as it's like that and not like, you know, overtly open with pieces, like they will let you get away with it as long as you're like, you know, um, I mean, if I can get away with it and I'm, a, I'm an adult, like literally, um, yeah, you'll be able to get away with it. So, um, yeah, that is um, one of the boxes. They are usually £14.99, but on the 1st of March, forced of, on the 1st of March, unfortunately, they went up to um, £16.99, which is just too bad. I mean, going up by like two quid, but um I don't know, inflation in the UK is pretty bad and that of course affects Lego as well. So anyway, that is um, one of my boxes and in this box I managed to fit a whole bunch of pieces. So again, I um, managed to get a bunch of these pieces and I did it by literally just stacking them up on top of themselves like over and over and over into a lovely long column and then just laying them in the box like so. I mean, it didn't shut, but again, they let me go away with it. So I will stop talking about that. Anyway, so... um. I got a bunch of lovely pink Lego pieces as well. So let me show you. So again, um, these are some of the pieces that I managed to fit in. So it is a pink one by one by one. And um, yeah, they can be used as lovely columns and I'm just really excited to use them. So I got a whole bunch of them, as you can see, just like, whoa, oh my God. I don't know what I'm gonna make out of it. Probably some kind of Barbie theme set or something. Um, but yeah, obviously I was there, I saw pink pieces. So how can I not buy them seriously? I mean, you know. <sighs> being gay and all. <laughs> anyway, no, I'm just joking. Um, but yeah, pink is just like literally my favourite colour. So that is um, a big reason why I bought them. Anyway, let me just put those there. Okay, right. I also got a bunch of these. So as you can see, I stacked them up again as well. And these are the pieces I actually use in my Five Nights at Freddy's videos to hold the characters. So, um, okay, here they are. So as you can see, they are some clear pieces with some uh, studs on the end that I can use to literally manoeuvre the characters around the studio. I say the studio, the sets and everything without, you know, doing the whole stop motion thing because I'm too dumb to do stop motion, literally. Do not, like, when you look at me, do you see some kind of, like, tech genius? No, I'm literally a himbo, so, like, do not ask me to edit my videos. Anyway, um, yeah, I got a bunch, whole bunch of those pieces. Literally, don't make me count them, please. Please don't make me count them. Anyway, um, so let me put those back. And, um... Yeah, I've got a bunch of those and also... Yeah, i got a bunch of other pieces as well. Don't know why I did that so weirdly, but um... Get out of here, box. Anyway, um... Yeah, so let me just tip them out in my, to my hand for you, just a few of them. So i got an entire cup full of lovely Lego heart pieces. Oh my gosh, lovely, lovely Lego heart pieces. Um, as you can see, this is what one looks like. I will just put it very carefully in my hand for you to look at. Okay, that is what it looks like. And um, yeah, I just got a whole bunch of these because I'd literally never seen them before. And the guy that I talked to there um, said they were going out of stock. So um, yeah, I just bought as many as I could basically. I don't know if they were left over from Valentine's or something, but I'm just so happy that I managed to get like so many of these 
lovely adorable pink heart pieces seriously i'm going to be doing something with my lego city with these um so that is those and i also got a whole bunch of lightsaber pieces well i say lightsaber pieces they are the blue lightsaber piece um of course not the um actual handle but um yeah i got a whole bunch of those as well that you're not going to believe how i've managed to fit these in basically do you know earlier how i was explaining that i would basically line up a whole entire row of these pieces and then literally place it in the lego box well i thought there's so much extra room going to waste so basically what i did was i popped these um lego lightsaber pieces into the um grate so literally i did that over and over and over and over again and that is how i got so many that is how i fit them in literally i don't have a life so i was just in there the whole night like literally popping them into place and this is like a long stack as well so it was like one one they'd fall in and then i'd do it again anyway um yep that is literally what you can do so I, I managed to get those extra pieces which i'm really happy about and um yeah as you can see i've already made something out of them so this is a lovely massive um great piece that you can see here and i'm going to be using this as a bay into my ship's engine room so currently i just have some road plates there which look quite ugly so i'm literally going to place this on top and um yeah i'll be able to put all kinds of um lego ships on top of that as well and um yeah i just also look so much smarter than just like a lego uh plate 32 by 32 because you know um, can look a bit like you know plain jane sometimes so this really will help you know distinguish that hey this is a massive ship that i've just spent so much time on and you know i'm, I'm taking it seriously so literally um made a whole honeycomb structure out of them um yeah literally i'm going too fast <laughs> anyway um so those are that that's those pieces that is the pieces that i managed to fit in my first box that is the piece Oh my god, I, I just have no, even though I live in the UK, I have absolutely no grip on the English language. Anyway, so that's those. Um, let me get um, the last box for you guys. So again, these are $16.99 a pop. So in total, I spent um, 34 quid on them, 34 pounds on them. So um, yeah, so this is the uh, final box. And as you can see, I absolutely just stuffed it stuffed it full of pieces like oh my gosh such big pieces seriously um but yeah um that is literally all of the pieces that i uh, managed to stuff in there i'm very good at cramming all those pieces in literally because you know i've just like how would you expect like all of these pieces to like cram into one box seriously you wouldn't you wouldn't so um yeah so let me <laughs> let me show you what's in here so um yeah as you can see got some lovely red tile pieces because these like literally never come um to lego shop so I thought I'd just get as many as I could while I was there. So um, yeah, you literally want to um, stack them like they were teeth or something. So um, literally take two stacks that are almost the length of the, almost the width of the box and just like double cross them like that. And you will manage to fit in so many more than if you were just, you know, throwing them in one at a time into your box. So um, yeah, that's literally what I did. And I had this idea because I wanted to build a massive roof for my mansion, but um you know, I'll probably end up saving them for when I make a massive um, Lego ocean liner again. So let me just take some of these out anyway. So that is those, those. And um, yeah, as you can see now, um, through the width of the box, I've actually got um, so many of them just lined up and everything. So um, yeah, that is the amount of red pieces that I managed to cram in there. So um, yeah, I also managed to fit a, another one of these lovely pink columns that I could just use as a cigarette or something. Just like, you know, be all French, like... <sighs> Mademoiselle, I don't fucking know French. Anyway, put that back. And um, yeah, um, a bunch of uh, black um, two by one by one pieces. So as you can see, that is the piece. Um, I don't know why I'm holding it so close to you. And yeah, I just managed to fit them in a few columns. Again, I'll probably save these pieces for um, my Lego uh, ocean liner when I end up rebuilding it because you know, literally so many pieces go into it that just, ugh, it's just like, I need to like seriously check my reserves when I start building it or like demolish it because I need to get like all these cartons sorted out and it's like a whole thing that I have to do. But um, yeah, that was basically it. So let me put these things back in. Um, I should just very smartly slot into, yeah, there they go. And that was so easy. Okay, right, that is, um, that's that. That can't close, but it doesn't matter. So um, yeah, I'm just really happy with all of the um, Lego pieces that I managed to get. And of course this thing, which I'm gonna use for my massive um, Lego ship. 
And of course, I will end the video by just spreading out a bunch of love hearts on my table, on my glass table, which is, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a good person. I like to like treat you guys. So that is literally my definition of a treat. Let me just move this thing out of the way. Okay, right, put that down there. Out of sight, out of mind. Okay, right. So these are those up. Those were all of the pieces, and um, yeah, bunch of Lego love hearts. So yay! I don't want to lose any. Yay! Okay, that is all of the. That is all of the Lego love hearts. So let me just put that back down. And um, yeah, I honestly should have got more of these. Seriously, they are. Just, oh my gosh, shit. Okay. Um, yeah, they are such a cute piece as well. So I'm just got so many ideas for them. I don't know. I could also like incorporate them into my makeup or something like, you know, probably I would put them like on my nails or something. I wouldn't like, these would look so cute on your nails as well. Oh my gosh, that would look so cute. Seriously. Imagine if I had all of these on my nails or something that would look like banging or something. Yeah, I couldn't really use them as makeup. What would I do? Like freckles i could actually do that that's an idea copyrighted don't steal my idea um yeah i might actually use these for like my angel dust cosplay if i can find some like some glue that actually you know doesn't fuck up your face so I could probably put them there 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 because he yeah, has those iconic freckles anyway me fucking going on to whatever um yeah that is basically all of the lego pieces that i managed to get from the lego shop and i'm just super happy that i got them such lovely pieces so let me just make a little pyramid out of them just because lining them up like i'm gonna play a game of pool or something anyway so oh no i can make a heart out of them oh my god how sick with that oh my gosh yeah okay that is a heart out of thousands of heart pieces literally why doesn't that look so cute oh my gosh such an artist anyway um yeah that is basically my lego video so i've been some lego twink um again if you like the video feel free to like and subscribe or leave me a comment or whatever because i'm not sure i and um yeah basically um thank you i want to thank you for making it through the video because i feel like i've been a bit hyper on something i mean i've had like, like <laughs> i have had a lot of caffeine today um i don't really think it affects me i mean no of course it doesn't um anyway um yeah that is basically the video for you guys and um hope you have a lovely day and um yeah just see you later i guess so um okay bye is that awesome that was uh, okay. Bye. Bye, cherubs. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. Okay. Wait. That. Okay. Didn't even see.